Jim Stein is here with today's FanDuel Hurry Up, talking about some players whose stock rose across week number three in NFL DFS. The first one is Chuba Hubbard, who stepped in for Christian McCaffrey and played really well and got the kind of touches we want for fantasy football. Hubbard had 10 carries, but more importantly, he had five targets. He also had five of the team's 11 red zone opportunities across the entire game. Hubbard played 38 snaps compared to Royce Freeman's 11 after McCaffrey went down. So it seems like Hubbard is going to be very much the one in this offense while Christian McCaffrey is out. The Panthers go down to Dallas in week number four for what should be a pretty fun game, so Hubbard will be a prime target for DFS at $6,300. Stock is also up for Odell Beckham, but more importantly, our stock is up because we get to watch Odell Beckham play football once again. And Beckham looked like his old self in week number three. He had nine total targets, and four of those were deep targets, lead 16 yards downfield. It did seem like Baker Mayfield was willing to trust Odell, let him go up, try to win some footballs. In week number four, they are playing against the Vikings in what should be a high-profile game, and I was hesitant on Odell initially because I wasn't sure how he'd play coming off two additional weeks missed due to his torn ACL, but week three gave me a lot of confidence, so the stock is way up in Odell heading into a potential shootout in week number four. Number three for me in week number three was Michael Pittman of the Colts, and the Colts didn't play well overall, but Pittman himself got a lot of volume in this game. He had 12 targets for the second consecutive game. That pushes Pittman's season-long target share up to 27%, and he has 53% of the team's downfield work so far this year. Yes, right now this offensive line is banged up with Quentin Nelson being hurt, Carson Wentz is not fully healthy, so the offense looks disjointed for sure. But Pittman is getting the volume that we want in this offense, and that can make up for a lot of ills for the overall context around him. So, things may be slow for a bit for Pittman given the offensive struggles, but he's getting good volume, which can erase that, and things should get even better as this team gets healthier moving forward. Michael Pittman, a guy who has shown he can get good volume in this offense, and things could get even better going forward as the Colts get healthier. So Michael Pittman, stock is up entering week number four. That's all we got here for today on the FanDuel Hurry Up. We will be back with you once again tomorrow to start taking a look at those waiver wires and getting you set for week number four in fantasy football. 